In the practice interviews, you must have seen me tell you many a times not to speak anything negative about any other person, whether it was your teaching attending or a colleague, maybe your med school or another researcher. Let me share with you a short a real life story to show you why speaking negative about a person only hurts you. So I was interviewing in a Boston hospital for a fellowship position. The interviewer looked at my resume and said, okay, you're a resident uh, in Detroit at, um, at this hospital. Isn't that where Dr. X works? Now, just to give you a little bit of background, um, Dr. X is one of the attendings whom I didn't really like. So I tried to answer this question by saying, yes, uh, I have worked with Dr. X, both in the hospital and the clinic. The interviewer then continued to look at my resume and saw my research work. He said, okay, and I see you have a good number of research publications during your residency. At that time, I kind of felt that maybe Dr. X was getting all the credit for the research when it was not true. So I became defensive and said this to the interviewer. Yes, I, uh, I do have uh, all the research publications that you see, but all the research work has been done with Dr. Y in medicine. Dr. X uh, didn't uh, you know, help me entirely in the research and we're still finishing up um, uh, uh, one of the projects that we started two years ago. In fact, Dr. X even discouraged me from going into the specialty. After the interviewer heard that, uh, he told me that um, Dr. X was his roommate in med school from another country. After that, there was a huge silence. I knew I was doomed. I knew I lost all my credibility and all my chances of matching into that program. To this day, I still regret having opened my mouth and spoken bad about a faculty member. So remember, the medical community, especially the teaching faculty members, it's a small community and they're well connected. They get to meet, meet each other, catch up uh, during these conferences. And so the residency selection committee will have absolutely no trouble you know, calling or speaking with your letter writers. So save yourself any grief and don't make the mistake that I did. Remember, keep a positive outlook throughout the interview. Stay strong, stay positive, practice, and feel free to sign up with me for a practice interview. All the very best.